So yeah, welcome to another RimWorld series. We're going to be playing RimWorld Alpha 13, which came out a few days ago. Unfortunately, the old saves are not compatible, so that's that's a bummer. But I'm playing this live on stream, which is great. Uh, so you can watch this on stream if you're right here right now. Welcome. If you're watching this on YouTube, you can probably catch me playing streaming RimWorld some other day. We're going to be playing with a new colony. I'm gonna be playing as Cassandra Classic on Base Builder. I think that's probably a good idea. I like Base Builder because I like building bases mostly. I don't want to play on rough. Rough, rough, rough. Okay, so let's uh, select this site. Yeah, advanced. Let's let's make it a little bit bigger. Yeah, starting season. All right, that's fine. I don't mind. You are playing on large. I think that's uh, that's gonna be a decent size for us. And we're gonna select this site over here. Seems good. Okay, we need our thing. We need our people now. We've got to randomize a few of these. Valerie Hartman. I want to like have a guy, maybe a male, because there are relationships now, and I want to be a male person. Teenage female colonist. That's not what I want. Male. I want to have them capable of everything. All of them to begin with. So I get a male colonist that is capable of everything. I don't like them being capable. Okay, that's good. Teddy Ted Grease is gonna be twisted. 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 And HBG. Keep Jesse the paramedic. I want to. Oh, that's your name! Alright. You have Jesse White, male colonist of age 33, capable of none. You have. You are missing your right ring finger, but that's fine. Actually, you're not missing, it's just hurt. Hey, you we can leave Jesse. We can leave Jesse. If you have any, like, uh, ideas for the nicknames or whatnot, names, let me know. Over here, I was going to maybe like get in get wicked in, but I have a better idea. Let's have a female colonist. No, I missed one. A female colonist is capable of everything. Age 32. That's a bit old for what I wanted, but that's fine. And we're gonna name her Taylor. Taylor. Take care. No, not take care. Taylor. Taylor Swift. Yeah, why not? We have Twisted the Paramedic, Just the Paramedic, and Taylor Swift the Miner. So that's gonna be a fun, fun crew. We're gonna hopefully do a lot of cool stuff. Don't make a colonist. I'm, I'm making colonists. Why not? I need colonists. So you are... You have a scar on your right leg, that's fine. You are... Oh, you and Jesse and Taylor Swift are lovers. That's gonna be interesting. You died this in the Aussie stream. No, that's a shame. Right, so I am... Sexy sick biologically, but yeah, we're gonna start out of this. I don't have any relationship with anyone. That sounds fine. Let's, let's give it a go. I'm gonna generate the map. Alright, so we're gonna land here. Can I kill her? Don't kill Taylor Swift, man. Taylor Swift is a treasure. She's awesome. Alright, here, here we go. We have a dog. We have a chiffin. A female husky of colony. Okay. You're gonna automatically. This is new. So this is one of the new features. If we go into a sign. Yeah, here. I think we can set their like reaction time. Let's set it all to flee. I like that. So who is? I should probably like check our colonist. We have that social. All of you like like each other, which is great. If you go to character. It kind of reminds me of Factorio. It maybe with the art style, but it's not similar at all. It's completely different. So who is the best with weapons? Where is that shooting? I can never find this properly. Shooting is zero. Okay, I'm really bad. Jesse, you are the best with weapons. So you're gonna get the shotgun, which is over here. I'm gonna get the pistol, and Taylor is really good at melee, right? Yeah, so we're gonna give her the knife, if we can, if we can find the knife. Where is the knife? There should be a knife somewhere. Is that the knife? Yeah, that's a knife. Alright, so those are all the weapons we need. We're gonna allow all of these things. Allow the wood. Allow the steel. Uh, components. Those are new. We wanna allow those. Silver also allow that. Okay, let's take a look at our map. So we have a lot of lakes. Hello, Kevin. What's up? We have some animals here. We have a building in this area. It's actually not as mountain as I expected. I was expecting more mountains. I guess I should have played in mountains instead of hills. But that's all right. That's fine. So we don't really have like a mountain we can dig into. No, we can dig into this area, I guess. I don't think there's like anything... The dangers here. What is this? That is Jade. That's new. Huh. 
All right, so where should we make our base? I think... Is this like a... Uh, that's mud. Not good. I think we could like make our base over here in this area. Or we have a little bit of a wall here. We can expand that. Extend that. Make it like over here. We can dig into the mountain. I like that idea. So first of all, we're gonna go into here. We're gonna set up a zone. We're gonna set up a stockpile zone. Like, let's say in this corner over here. Um... Remove this. No, no, no. Construct the zone. And just delete the zone. Yeah. Zone. Let's get a stockpile zone like here. A dumping stockpile zone. Get one over here. Just just let something small to begin with. And we are going to unpause the game, finally. Build a room. I know I need to build a room. It's gonna happen. I'm gonna dig into this mountain. This seems like a good home for us right now. I, I feel happy with that. So we're gonna order something here. We're gonna order them to mine this area. Like mine a quarter over here. Yeah, this game is really fun. I think it's a really, really cool game. All right, so we're gonna keep doing this. It reminds me of Hearthstone, really? Why does it remind you of Hearthstone? It's not really similar to that. You mean Stoneheart? I could see that. It colonies beds. I know, I know. They're doing stuff right now. Is what is this? This is a grizzly bear. Oh my! That that could be dangerous. Yeah, you mean Stoneheart, not Hearthstone. Hearthstone is Blizzard's card game. Stoneheart is like the city builder thing. And I'll set up a big room over here. Yeah. It's gonna take us a while to dig everything in, but it's fine. It's okay. So, all of you actually should be working in on everything. I won't set up the priorities just yet. I want to enable everything to everyone to do everything. That's what I like to do. I know it's probably not the most optimal thing ever. I like doing that. Also, who is the best person at taming animals? Let's see. Character. Handling. Animals. Four. Three. Four. I think I'm gonna tell Twisted because he has a passion for it. Everyone does a little bit. I'm gonna tell Twisted to actually like train the dog. Yeah, so you're gonna be have training. Obedience. You can actually do everything, which is awesome. So I want you to cannot. Oh, we have no food right now. That's good. I mean, it's not good, but that's we, don't, we cannot really do anything about. So there's now a nifty little progress bar here, which is very nice. And actually, I'm gonna go into like work. The architect. I'm gonna cancel like this entire thing. Yeah, just focus on mining this. I'm gonna cancel this. Just focus on mining this little room. I'm gonna place some beds in here. I'm gonna expand it later. There's a lot of skill here that we can use later on. For a good cause. They're socializing, they're talking. Jesse and Taylor are having a ton of fun. They talk about hearts. And they will go on. Okay, so now we need to build some things here. We have the the basic room. It's still really dirty, it doesn't have a decent floor, it's just a, it's just a cave right now. But if you go into structure and we can set up a door, a wooden door, not enough store, that's fine, we can get more wood easily. We have some where we landed, right? I will give them a room alone, but first first of all, it's gonna be like, it's 5pm, we need to have a place to sleep in. So first of all, we're gonna all sleep in the same room, then we're gonna give everyone a separate area to sleep in. We're gonna move the beds easily. If we want to. Alright, work. Let's uh, go on, on architect into orders and let's uh, chop some of these trees. They're not growing yet, but it's gonna give us a bit of wood. It's gonna be helpful. We gotta chop them down. We have trees nearby, but we gotta chop them down. It's not instant. Now we have a door. Now we're gonna have a roof here. Overhead mountain. Okay, that's not like the ideal roof, but it works. Furniture. Uh, we want some wooden beds. I could go for steel beds. As you can see my resources up here, I have a ton of steel, but I feel like I wanna... Because it's 35. Ah, you know what, we can get steel easily. Uh, let's, let's actually get a double bed for Taylor and Jesse. Uh, like, steel bed. I selected a... no, no not a roll bed, like this one. Uh, just a steel bed over here. In this area. And then we can have a normal steel bed in this corner for twist for now. 
Actually, let's prioritize. This deserved. Okay. If you build that, that's gonna be great. I'm gonna sleep in a bed. It's gonna be nice and cozy. And automatically, they took their own bed. So now they're sleeping together, which is great. That's actually a new feature. Previously, people could not sleep together. I'm all alone. I know. It's sad. It's alright, though. No biggie. Build a room. I mean, this is a room, technically. It doesn't have proper walls, but it's a room. Does it count as a room here? Or is this? Mode. Where is the room? Room stats. It is a room. It's called the, the barracks. Huh. It's repulsive. <laughs> it's hideous. It's very dirty. It's a really bad room. But it's ours. Alright. So they're waking up. They're gonna go eat something. We need to get, set up some food. We have some meals for now. There's some packet survival meals there. But we need to get more stuff. So first of all... We're gonna get a steel wall. Just to like go all the way here. To like wall this area off. Because we want to be protected from raiders if they come from this direction. This is going to be our, like our base. Like this area, this little circle area is gonna be our base for now. We will mine this later on. Ton of stuff stored. We do want to get some food somehow. Um, so ideally we can keep this as our temporary barracks for now. And we can go into work. Architect orders mine. Set up a few more rooms. Like another room over here with another door that's like in this area at the edge. And that could be our kitchen slash cafeteria. So we, in there we're gonna put a cooking table and whatnot. Don't get uh, locked out, please. Gonna have to chop down the trees, that's fine. They're doing everything right now, they're not like in a hurry. Could kill the rabbit, probably will. A lot of hair. Is there a hair here? Who ate the hair? I have to keep in mind, the grizzly bear will actually like get, get hungry. Look at the needs. He is a carnivore, so once he gets hungry, he's gonna hunt. And he's gonna kill things. Yeah, this game is awesome. It's still in early access, this is Alpha 13. It will come out on Steam this month, I think. So it's gonna be really fun to play that when it comes out. Is there a gate in this game? What do you mean a gate? Like a... Like a gate for this wall? Not really, there's doors which are these blocks. But you can set up like a corridor with turrets, because there are turrets. If I go into like uh, security, we have turrets that we can place that will kill enemies. There, there are raids. There will, enemies will come to us. If you look at factions, we can see that we have two hostile factions. We have uh, the Colmea Legua Basculo, and we have the Agony Organization, which is a pirate band. But yeah, this bear is a problem. We need to kill it, because it will be hungry. We gotta, like, mine these things first. Also, it's uh, 20 degrees outside, so it's, it's like, a, it's fairly comfortable. Could be worse. Don't poke the bear, lady. Going for a walk. Also, what is this? Compacted machinery. What? That is new. Okay, there's a boar. Go back to work, please. Thank you. And this is so, this is very, very dirty. They have to clean it. They will clean it once I tell them to. Okay, so you're doing fine with this. If I go into, like, architect. In, uh... Furniture? No. Production. Yes. What is 22 Celsius in Fahrenheit? 22 Celsius is room temperature. So that's... Like, normal temperature in a room. I don't know what that's in Fahrenheit. I can switch the display, but I don't understand Fahrenheit. 22 is room temperature. It's like... Chemi in chemistry, it's literally... 22 is literally room temperature. Electric stove. We use a fuel stove. Place this thing over here. There, like that, like that. It's good. And also, we will need some power. Do we have a geyser nearby? We do not. I don't see any geysers at all, actually. We have seen one over here. It's pretty far away. 
we're gonna go over here into architect and we have power so we need we have a fuel generator that's a new thing and that is basically used for making power with wood so we don't have a ton of we have actually a lot of wood right now so you know what can we actually like cancel this and go into architect into production and make a fuel stove because that uses wood And we don't have to worry about that. Alright, so it's missing fuel. We need to refuel that. That's fine. I'm gonna go and get some wood for that. that that's alright. Where are you going with that wood? Holding wood to stockpile zone 1. What? Oh, that wood. Alright. So this is now fueled. Which is great. If we go to furniture, we can set up a table. A wooden table. Like in the corner here. Gonna have some wooden stools. It's 71 Fahrenheit. That sounds very hot. Even though I know it's not. Okay. We have that. Also, I do want to set up a, a little, like, fridge over here. So we'll do it like this and just open this area up. It's gonna be our little fridge for now. Yeah, th there are fridges. You can make a fridge. They're still sleeping, though. They're probably gonna be really unhappy if we look at uh, their needs. Joy is going down. I mean, they're not that unhappy. Man, you Taylor is really happy to sleep be sleeping with you, Jesse. She has like an eight bonus, which is awesome. <laughs> 